Oh, that's that's all you can really hope for there. And uh, yeah, so I think ultimately a, a story and a scar, and uh, I'll be good in no time. That's good. Yeah. See, Tori does the down throw there instead of fair, it's just a little bit more damage. Proceeding here. I wonder if these two have played against each other much, because I know Wally traveled for Cold Heart Smash. I'm sure he's been to a couple other events that Tori's been to. I think they played at the Mom Memorial. Okay. I want to say Wally won, but I'm not 100% like that. Both quite solid players. You see him when, when, when Tori's crouching there, as Wally's coming down, she's wanting to see uh, Wally land in down tilt range, get like a down tilt up there to get the kill. Uh -huh. I think FD is probably definitely a chic favorite stage in this matchup, but I also think most of them are. Honestly, I, I think she probably runs on most stages in this matchup. I feel like that makes sense. This could realistically be chic. Like among high tools, of course. Yeah, He's facing the back air on the shield around the I feel like people would have said Falcon for a while, but I, I don't know about that these days. Yeah, I think Falcon's just like all in all just a better character than Bunch is. I agree. Faster Sheik beats Sheik, it just makes sense. Surprised he still had his four after that. He's jumped the leg. Okay. Some nice peach offense. Slow get up. Sheik with advantage at that point. Ooh. Right the dash. Yep. Good on. Tori with the full stack of needles. Ooh, wow, <laughs> no jump, that's rough. Ooh, her needles. Uh, juicy fair. It's like an upper from the ledge. Wow. That was really nice from Wally. I feel like in a situation like that, you probably want to crouch to the first hit of down smash, you get by the second and go to the other side of the stage. I like, agree. Well, a couple times in a row now. Probably going high. And at that point, Wally's not even going to give her the chance anymore. Yeah. He's going to just go through it there. Oh, uh, yeah. If she fared that turn up, she could, like, run into it the first part of upbeat. I mean, it's kind of Down turn to the yeah, up air doesn't have parent follow up, especially when she's on the court for him. Oh. Oh, down. Oh, I think up air might have done it there, honestly. Only the up B, Wally able to find the ledge, but probably a hit after this grab will do it. Tori's got to play very safe here, can't let herself get thrown off the stage. Needle up smash? Still allowing herself to be down smashed off. Maybe she doesn't know about the crouch cancel joint. Well, she must though, right? Like, maybe she's not confident in it? It's hard to time it for just one. Yes. Yeah, it is a little tricky. Like modern peaches really like Yoshi's, so I think that's why you would go there. Wally went to Yoshi's two games in a row against me when we played at Cold Heart Smash. I believe he, he like strikes there against Mark. Yeah, like yeah, that's what happened. Nice down there, up there. Wow, nice edge, edge cancel. cancel. If he had tried to go in and punish that, that would have been free back. There. Wait for Tori. Right. Down smash wars. <laughs> you can't beat Tori in a down smash war. She's a seasoned veteran. 
Got to trade. I'm not sure with what. Shoot there. Oh, -ho! that's gonna get damage. Back air. Good ledge grab. Grab throw. Another thing that I feel like Tori can be doing when her shield's a little low is to start light shield, because then you're not going to get shield poke by the down smash. Yeah. But that was like a full shield poke, so she was good. Yeah, it was, it was such a good shield. It was a great F tilt, like, as soon as possible, too. Really went Ooh. for it there. Glad you didn't go to the ledge. Nice wait. Down smash. Throw up there. Hard to hit that on that, too. Nice needles. Setting up the edge grab. Oh, big damage off this. Damn, yeah. Full needles, maybe. Gonna help out a bit. No back? You gotta check that, Tori. Come on. Oh, stitch face. Do it. Probably meant to throw it up and drift forward, but did the opposite. No jump. Not gonna be able to survive that. I feel like with better DI though. Tori with some well spaced aerials. Attacking on the percent. There. And then another looks like it's like drop shield F till that Bonfire has used a couple times to effect. I mean it's fairly fast, but as long as you're not gonna get like down smashed after. It's just kinda funny seeing it used uh, effectively. She was in a terrible position. I think just about anything else would have gone punished. Sharking really well. Wally able to get down. Now Bonfire's on the platform. Then they're just next to each other. When Wally's crouching on a platform, Tori seems too scared to go for up air. Like, you can just beat that outright if you space right and time it well. I call that like a she can manage to. Nice. The snaky leg, man. Best back air in the game, arguably. It's bigger than Puffs. I didn't realize that. Yeah, it's crazy. Damn. It's best of five. Everything's best of five here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What it seemed like after the first one. Nice, the rising air is out of shoot. Real slick. Yeah. I think an up air would have hit it. Nice. I know that like Peach has, you know, more survivability, like quote unquote, here. But honestly, like I feel like the space is more beneficial to Sheik. And also like Sheik is a character who has like down throw up there, down throw there kills so for the high percent. But then also like she's really good. She's one of the few characters who's good at gimmick Peach. Uh huh. So it can be not as good of a peach counter pick as some might think. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. I think that like Fountain has like the benefits that Peach gets here without the downsides. Uh -huh. That's rough. We got to hold on to that lead. Well, as long as she doesn't get hit with like some crazy scary death bomb, this game's pretty. Especially when it's two characters that have projectiles and use projectiles. I feel like the character that has the movement 
advantage will be, I don't know, will we'll like the, the space. Oh, wow. At least before her untimely SD, she brought him back to Kokosun. Play it slow. Wait, dash on his way back. Fair through the tournament. Wally with a few wins in neutral in a row. No, you got the lead finally. You gotta grab that. Yeah, the bonfire ended the run with a hit. Gets the next decisive win in neutral, but Wally finds the ledge. Trade giving him enough time to like find his footing. Bonfire with stage. She baited out a down smash by the ledge there, but then, like, didn't move in fast enough to punish it, which could have been a stock. Another nair out of shield it was that, uh, that gave Sheik stage control and then finding the kill after that. She's probably just looking to pick away with some needles for the sun. Yep, so down. Even if you die right now, that's a decent lead. Yeah, that's huge. It's like... It's like uh, on one night the way there got down throw up air killing. Oh wow, two, two SDs. So keep calm, taking a second to breathe and think, I like it. If she can keep finding F tilts like that, um, I don't know, I like her chances. Oh, that didn't even look great. Oh wow, just gotta clean up this edge guard. Honestly, that point just grab ledge and back air. Yeah. There's not much else, like, there's not much to do. It looked like it might have been a little uh, ambiguous, but I think grabbing the ledge and back air was the, the best call. Yeah, like, even when it's ambiguous, like, he, I don't think he even had a chance to land the stage there. So, like, you can just back air and cover whatever, like, drift and wait. Miss the dash. Wally capitalized a little bit off of Bonfire's decision to go in there. Or is that a little spook? That doesn't matter if you get one hit. That's true. There it is. <laughs> I, I, I would better run it back. I don't know. Oh, it's such a weird game with all the SDs. That's true. Because like if you just look at like neutral exchanges and punishes, I think Wally actually has an edge there. But the SD to zero, whereas Tori SD to like a hundred. Bad drift on the air. That could have been a stock, honestly. Yeah. That might be. Left. Oh, I don't know. Left oh. Yeah, that was odd. Maybe she thought she landed on stage and was trying to crash cancel it? Nice fares. You gotta clean this up, Tori. How are you doing it? I thought the up air was gonna come out like at the last second. Oof. Ooh, wow. Brave. I would have not gone for that there. And it was a sick like dive bomb bear from Wally. Ooh, not strong. Okay. Level oh, down. Now you're dead. Quick 20. Or you gotta keep them in the corner. Oh wow, Careful. tech roll in again, I dare you. Nice punish. Uh, I think she thought the dare would like beat the turn, but it just barely did. 
while he got like at least what he needed there a few hits keep building on his lead finds a strong there and has the opportunity to clean this up slow get up strategically used Tori's been pretty good at sharking those like extended edge guards a little far out Game might be over. I mean, it's never over, but like, it's not looking good. I agree. A lot of momentum for Wally. Still no jump on Sheik. And... Okay, not quick enough with. I like the decisions. I doubt Wally will let her go back to Battlefield. For that matter. So I'm thinking it's probably going to be a stadium game next. Then again, Wally won on FD, so she could go there. Oh, they are going, they're running it back. Now, who won here last again? I can't remember. It was uh, uh, Wally, right? Yeah, but Tori won on it. Two. Gotcha. It's the third dream I can't even say. Okay. <laughs> Wally with uh, an advantage here. Nice there, I think still no jumps. Oh, I tried to jump in with the first part of the would have been big. I just feel like she's dying too easily on some of those, like, wash, rinse, repeat, peach edge guards. Yeah, I agree with that. Nice. Keeping up the corner pressure. Nice. That got hurt a lot. Wally stays high for a while. Nice picks up before he drifts all the way to the left ledge. Only one of those moves hit. Charging up. Platform. Ooh, excellent there. Yeah. Tipped toe. A lot of good displays. A lot of good displays of uh, Sheik's rising there. Get out of shield. That was like almost a zero to death after getting almost zero to death. Like, momentum swung pretty huge there. Now it looks like it's swinging again. Good coverage. Wally's offense has been pretty effective. I feel like for most of the set. For sure. Sneaking some like jabs and jab grabs in there. And it's found a lot of the grabs. High hit percentage on them. Tori is like starting out a bit more now, but I think it's good. He didn't work in that scenario there. She takes a second, finds a needle, finds a bear. Nice. Ah, uh, missed the ball up there. That could have been big. Juicy dash attack for Peach there. Nice crouch cancel. That trajectory to knock a ball is is just so sick. For fair? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. For sure. Especially when they hold it right down the way and they kind of tip just a bit. Excellent. Wow. Tori's flexing too here. Wally's up with one wanting trades. True. I like how she moved into that fair coming off of the top flat. Some rolls to set up a shield grab, and now a bonfire going to work, but... That trade is rough for yeah. sure. Not making that. Taking a second, thinking it out. Part of me wanted to see her just like forward throw and then like wait a half second and then just fire the needles. I'm surprised that turn, that turn up literally disappeared like a frame before you even hit that. 
One or two that seemed like tech flubs, but because of the nature of certain F smashes and how they move your character's frame, like it kind of she got out of the way. Good set. It was. I believe I am up to bat now, so I'll have to get off of this commentary. Nice Boy. working with you, Pete. Yeah, it was a pleasure, man.